Tech MW. Welcome back to another beautiful Tech MW video. You might notice this iMac is brand new. I will get into this in another video, but the focus of today's video is this. Now this is my M1 2020 MacBook Pro. Oh yes, it's uh, it's it's a beauty, all right, it's a beauty. It's not actually running Big Sur, by the way, it's it's running the newest one, which is, which is so, so no, um, whatever, the, uh, that one. And you know, it's running, it's running great, you know. The focus of today's video is seeing if this MacBook Pro can run Fortnite. Now, we've seen the gaming performance of the M1. We saw it with the M1 iMac, which we have sat over here however we are going to try fortnite on the m1 macbook pro also you may notice whoa look at all this i know right this took ages to install some of the panels have kind of gone out of alignment though which is a bit annoying but yeah we've got all this i call it the tech mw wall so um you know we've got the whole desk and everything so we're gonna get into this and we're gonna see if this beauty can run fortnite we've got eight cores for performance for yeah eight gigs. this is the thing i'm not sure about with the m1 max the eight gigs of ram i'm just i'm i'm not sure that will that will last an entirely good amount of time but you know it is what it is eight core gpu so we've got the you know the, the better version now i have downloaded the epic games launcher and we're gonna hello what is this the last time you open epic I, it was definitely not force quit. I'm actually genuinely not sure if this runs natively or if it runs through Rosetta 2. We do have an issue though. You see, this isn't gonna be the most up-to-date Fortnite because apparently the Apple and the Epic Games people kind of fell out. So uh, they uh, kind of stopped updating Fortnite, which was, you know, really nice. So this is stuck on a really old version. I don't know how old it is, but when I downloaded it, it was about half the size of what it was on Windows, which is a bit of a problem, but it's fine. It, it's fine. It, 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 it's Fortnite, all right? It, it is Fortnite. We're gonna hit launch in three, two, one. Hello? Ah! I'm not really sure what to expect with this performance. So, you know, we'll we'll see. All right, we've got Save the World Battle Royale. Oh, this is a really old version, isn't it? Okay. Oh, the menu, though. Look at the smoothness of the menu. Let's try... No, we'll, we'll leave that. Let's try Battle Royale. Okay, let's see if there's any players online at all. Because this is an old version. So it doesn't share the same servers as the new one, which is a bit naff, but it's fine. Ah, uh, here we go. Right, yes, yes. This looks so plain as well. Like, what is going on? Play, here we go. Right, we got elapsed 10 seconds. Okay, this is good. This is fine. It'll be, it'll be fine. It only, it's only got to find like 99 other people, hasn't it? This is going to take a while, isn't it? It's got to find 99 other people using this specific version on Mac. Ooh, ooh. I doubt there's even a hundred people online, to be honest. First of all, let, let, let's let's just let's just have a little look at you know what what settings it's defaulted. 1440 by 900. Okay, 60 FPS. That's a high, high, high. Get out. Get out. No, just no, no way. No way does this, will this actually run? How do I get out of this? I, I'm not a Fortnite player. How do I get out of this? Close. Right, I don't have a right mouse button. Okay, it worked. Okay, how do I, how do I get out of this? There we go. There we go. Okay, save the world. Failed to retrieve. No longer playable on Mac. Oh, brilliant. All right then, creative. No, no, we are playing Fortnite. It's actually, okay, people, we are, oh my goodness. Okay, it's real. It's actually, <gasps> what? No way. This is on high at 1440 by 900. This is, look at this. This is running like a gaming PC. Right, let's go setting, right? Let's see if it can hand... We can't go any higher, can we? Okay, let's turn this up to like unlimited frame rate and let's show FPS. I'm actually struggling to believe that this is running this well on here, but it is. Based on that, I doubt this is running through Rosetta because this is running too good. It might just be this powerful. I mean, it is an eight core GPU. 
and like they were comparing it to like RTXs and all sorts. This is amazing. 70, you know what? I'm gonna try running this 2560 by 1600. We're still getting 40 FPS. This is on 2560 by 1600 at high. I don't, right, I, I don't know how to play Fortnite, okay? So we're gonna just kind of build. How do I, how do I, how do I build? What does that do? That doesn't do anything. Can I do that? No. Can I can I do anything with that? No, no. Can I can I do anything with this tree? I would also like to point out that this is now running at nearly 50 FPS. I can't hear the fan. And I feel like I'm just whacking this tree for no reason. Solid 40 FPS. It can go up to 50 as well. This is great. This is like it does okay, maybe it's stuttering a little bit, but I'm not really it's not dropping down to like 20 FPS every five seconds. Like it is running. You know what? M1 MacBook Pro, I am very impressed with you. I am very impressed with you. This is this is good. You know, this is this is exquisite performance right there. This is this is moist performance right there. That's what I'm calling it. Yeah, this is crunchy good performance. I'm just going to leave that before my M1 explodes. It's actually not even that warm. I don't have a temperature gun or anything. It's warm. It's lukewarm. Okay? Okay? It's like, it's like, I don't know how to describe it. It's like a, a lightly microwaved glass of water. That's, that's what I'd say. Exit out of that. Uh, confirm. There we go. How has it physically done that? No, genuinely. How have Apple done that? Apple are genuinely using cheat codes. It was just like, yeah, you know what? We're going to take the old MacBook Pro. We're going to, you know, cut the power consumption to a third, increase the battery life and it just performs like 18 times as good. Like what? This receives the Tech MW rating of shockingly impressed. So there you go. All right then, I think, well, I think we, we've done what we wanted to do. That's not normal for a Tech MW video. We have literally done exactly what we intended to do and it worked fine and it worked really well actually. So I don't really know what else to say other than thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed this one, please do leave it a like and don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to join the amazing Discord server. We are growing and, uh, you know, we're always looking for people to chat to. I'm always online and all that good stuff. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this beautiful Tech MW video and I'll see you in the next one.